everybody, welcome back. Spelunky 2. It's the same day. I, I could be recording anything else. I could be. But I, you know what? Maybe it's time we act a little skin change here. Guy. That's, that's my dude right there. What does mine say? Guy! What does mine say? Dude! Anyway, long story short, I can't just leave Spelunky 2 in this cursed position. That, I'll admit, I didn't think it was worth it, and I didn't think it would work. But in my head, sometimes you gotta be a Pog engineer. You gotta set up moments where Pog can flourish, and then if they do, more Pog to you, is what I say to that, sir. That's what I say to that. Oh, baby, getting creamed by your own treasure. Treasure. Anyway, what was I saying? Long story short. I don't promise the world in this episode. But I promise we're gonna do our best. We're gonna channel our Samwise Gamgee. I made a promise, Master Frodo, that I would do my best to get to the duat, and I aim to keep it. I feel like I I don't I don't know if my Samwise voice is that good, but my cadence is like. I understand what he's going for. Because I understand what he's going through, dude. Who amongst us hasn't helped a friend walk to Mordor? The shores of Mount Doom. A lot of people will tell you it probably was not worth HP to get one HP. Those people would be correct. And I'm jealous of their foresight. I forgot the skeleton was locked in there. But that's okay. It's not a terrible floor, all things considered. Broke even on HP. 13,000, probably about maybe 16 or 17, on an altar. About 16 or 17,000 by the time we get to the shop. And remember, it hasn't really been working out the way we wanted it to so far, but we are trying to take an approach of aggravating shopkeepers less unless there's a good reason to do so. And although it did not work out very well in the last episode, I certainly think that the potentiality is there for it to work out well in the future. This is a tricky floor. There's a lot to hate. <laughs> That's what I wanted to see, because then I can drop this. We can whip that so we can still get to the key. Do you think... Ah, frick. Um, let's see what the shop has for sale. Because, like... I mean, we're probably not going to go through the vault. You know what? We're actually probably going to do it like this. We already know we're using a rope to get back up because we need to get... Uh, we need to sacrifice as much as possible. I think maybe over here there's like a thin spot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead, coward. I'm bad, dude! It's okay. Blew him sky high. Minute and a half. Minute and a half is a lot of time. Could do a lot of damage to the enemies. We could do a lot of damage to ourselves, quite frankly. Um, we know we got to spend the rope to get out there. So I'm, I'm actually super stoked we got more ropes. Now, I know you're like, don't sack this yet. You're absolutely right. We won't sack it, but we will drop it off. Kind of the same thing right here. We're going to sack Monty first because it's got to be done. We might want the cash involved with that ghost pot. It's hard. We, we don't have, a, you know, all the time in the world, unfortunately. I'm a little cheesed, quite honestly. I mean, how many ropes do you have to use on, like, a single run? Or on a single floor, I should say. It's getting a little much. So I do want the... Oh, I didn't sack him, dude. I walked him by the door accidentally. Okay, so here's what we're going to do instead. I never had a choice. We're going in. And we're going off. With only one HP. Don't get me wrong, definitely burns me up a little bit. I love a hover pack though, dude. I love a hover pack. I, I can't deny it. I, I think maybe I overrate it. And I underrate a power pack quite immensely. I can't deny it. 
So many, like, misused altars lately. Just getting nothing out of the altars at all. Which is, like, completely my own fault, by the way. You know what I wanted to see? If you could get extra bounce off that. Because, like, we really... Well, I know what you're gonna say. You're gonna be like, why wouldn't you just take the turkey? <sighs> why wouldn't you take the turkey for HP? I honestly don't think it's worth it, just because our bombs are quite low. At, at this level of HP, we can, you know, just get the HP via Monty, I think, and then hope to... Hope to get a little extra source later. You know, like get a Kapala later, for example. I don't know, man. I mean, it's it's not the way I drew this one up in advance. But we are here now. <laughs> How do you like it? You know what? We didn't kill him. Maybe we can reset the aggro. It's within the realm of possibility, at least. Well, I guess we'll be leaving Monty behind. I've become too reliant on the Kapala. This is very clear to me now. Ho 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 ho, buddy. I've become over reliant on the Kapala. I'm throwing away HP for no reason, but you know what? I do want to go back to Volcania. There's something wrong with me. I have to go back to Volcania because I'm like, it's been beating me. It's my white whale. We got to get through it. Okay, so you, I don't wish to kill you. That's two floors with no kill. If we can avoid killing the shopkeeper here, that would be amazing. But it is definitely worth noting... Lucky me. Um, that... Let's hope this doesn't screw up our key. It's definitely worth noting that... Uh, It's my fault, that's what hurts. But... Come on, man. <laughs> well, never mind what I was about to say. I don't even remember where I was going. I was just kind of making up that one as I went along. Um, that's alright. One... Oh, that hurts, though. But one mistake... And one loss in a video... Does not a bad Spelunky video make, you know? We could just call that a warm-up. Did I miss anything down here? This is what you want to check for. Did I miss anything down here? I love how, you know, it's no surprise to me. I am my own worst enemy. Sleeping with my clothes on. Can we forget about the clothes I wore when I was sleeping? Um, sorry, that's more uh, mouth dreams. I apologize. But... Um, Ooh, now this is my kind of altar. What I was gonna say is I'm my own worst enemy because I can't uh, not kill the shopkeepers. Even when I'm like, well, we've, we've been doing a really good job not killing shopkeepers lately. I'm like thinking back and I'm like, I'm pretty sure we've murdered shopkeepers at every single opportunity thus far. So we really, if we don't want to be bad, we should take the Torky with us. The thing is... I'm gonna be bad. Because we can't, no matter what, we have to use a rope to get this turkey up there. We need as much gold as possible. If we're gonna be buying things from shopkeepers, ooh, then we can't be just ignoring gold that's relatively easy to get. I'm gonna leave you there because we might be able to cheese that and save a rope. Ride a cowboy. So this is not really worth it. I do want to sack the torque though. I do want to sack the torque. Okay. It's going to look a little bit like this. We, we don't have a ton of time. I was literally just about to say we got tons of time. We don't have a ton of time. So you really got to handle this one. Pretty expeditedly. 
We got 5 HP. That's beautiful. Is this guy... He's not gonna be mad. He's not gonna be mad. Why you have to be mad? It is only game. Oh, you gotta admit, it was it was a valiant effort. Okay, so two ropes puts us down to one rope. And we still need a lot more, but at least we've charted a course. And at least we got something out of the altar this time, instead of my historical uh, st uh, standard of zero. I was gonna say, we're probably gonna need to use another rope to get through here, but maybe there's a jetpack? Maybe there's a jetpack? Definitely there's a jetpack. I don't want anything else from that shop, so... Honestly, assuming we can still get back... Well, because we will be able to get back up, because we got a freaking jetpack, dude. So you just buy this, get the frick out of town, and then look for some bodies to sacrifice. They do not exist. Are you willing to kill Yang? I'm willing to kill Yang to get the Kapala. Will this give us the Kapala? I don't know. Either way, we're very happy to have the jetpack. We're very happy to have new prospects for uh, altars in the future, probably. I think this was the right way to handle this. We can take a ghost pot, and the maneuverability that we get here is, is beautiful. And the fact that we're at zero ropes matters not. Okay, this is good stuff. Don't care for anything else. That's good stuff. Okay. The, I know you're probably feeling the same thing I'm feeling right now, which is this one now feels like it could be the one. Like Shania Twain sang about, you know, you're still the one I belong to. How many Shania Twain songs can you name? I'm like, I'm not trying to flex too much. I bet I can name more Shania Twain songs than you. You ready to start? Let, let's play a little interactive game, shall we? A little game within a game. Inception. Not a Shania Twain song. Just a slapper of a movie. Um, he's back. He's got banter again. Okay. Whose bed have your boots been under? Uh, honey, I'm home. And I had a hard day. Man, I feel like a woman. Any man of mine. Still the one. Up. I know you're like, oh, I didn't think he was going to know up. Oh, I know up. <laughs> that don't impress me much. Could still be the one. That was a big mistake, but this could still be the one. Where the heck was... Where the heck was I supposed to go here? Just plow through. Where the heck was... I'm at the top? Is this... No, no, hold on. This is all wrong. <laughs> How the heck did I get down here before? Where am I? I think I got my polarity reversed somewhere. There we go, okay. Are you out of Shania, Twi uh, Shania Twain songs? I think I am, and that's that's burning me up, because I know I got like five or six just in my head. Uh, get you good. Get you good. That's one. Just like I should. I'll get you good. There's so many more. Oh, no! I'm, like, upset. Just thinking about Shania. One arrow trap is lit on fire. As a result, ruins your run. You know, this is one where you... Sometimes you just gotta give your brain a second to figure it out. That was a situation where using a rope was necessary. Even though I thought we could throw something up there. Maybe you could, but... Maybe you could. <laughs> I will I will stand by the fact that I think we got two things going on right now. This has not been my best play in Spelunky 2. We also have had uh, maybe not an insane amount, 
But a disproportionate amount of evil has befallen us. Uh, like Derek's dastardly Rube Goldberg machine has been running at full tilt poker. Look, we got tons of sacrificable ammunition here. Like, I mean, the other thing is we don't even have to... Yeah, we could just do that. Monty must live, though. Sorry, Monty. It didn't have to be that hard to begin with. That was huge. Get over there. Okay. Yeah, get over there. You know what? <laughs> Just die. <laughs> this is like pretty much the worst way we could have handled that, I think, but we got the job done. Oh, get cursed, dummy. Okay, beautiful. Probably could have gotten that emerald with some clever platforming, but honestly, I think trying to be clever has gotten us in a lot of trouble recently. All right. So what do we do next? Not being a dummy. Big part of my survival strategy. This is huge. This was an important first step here. There you go. Just just let it ride. You can work with this. You can get a power pack. You can turn it into HP. Shouldn't be blowing those up so close to them, but it is what it is. It's already been done. We do want the other turkey. You know, to some degree, like, what did I expect? We didn't take any damage in the process. It's just kind of tedious. <laughs> There we go. Okay. Yang must be chilling at the bottom here. If we can get to 20 grand, we can buy the jetpack. The jetpack's just nice to buy to begin with because of the fact that it explodes. So I, I would sacrifice a lot to make sure we got the jetpack. Like, if we have to use... Well, we probably don't have to use the ghost pot. Instead, thankfully there's no spikes there. Well, we don't even need to do anything. Oh, it only takes 19,800. We could just use a rope instead. And using one rope uh, to secure the jetpack is, is pretty sensible. We could kill the shopkeeper. You're not wrong about that. We could kill the shopkeeper. Then we'd have a jetpack and a gun, probably. Or we'd be dead, one of the two. But we might die regardless. And I mean, come on, you want to live forever? It just, like, okay. When you when you take that damage... Um, even that was spicy. When you take that damage from the pot, you kind of accept it. When you run into the enemy from so far away... That's where you go, what's wrong with me? But you know what? In many ways... All of my content on the internet is just a roundabout way of answering that question. Okay, jetpack should make the Kapala very easy to get. Just use your brain first. So we got enough money. We definitely want to buy a bomb box. This is a decent opportunity to kill the shopkeeper. Uh, not least of which because we'd be able to sabotage him, or sacrifice him if you will. Absolutely worth checking. Very glad, by the way. That we did not buy the spike shoes would have made that impossible. You know what's going on in there. I don't need to tell you. So we don't want to sack Monty. We want to sack like a caveman if possible. Hello. Fancy seeing you here. He's dead, huh? Well, it's fine. Alive is worth more, but... Donkey, donkey, dunk -da -dunk. Plenty of time, dude. Oh my god, I love having a jetpack, man. You know Monty's probably going to be gettable. So this is like a really, really good Kapala chance. Come on, man. Don't make me murder the shopkeeper just to get to the Kapala. I'm, I'm, I'm axing you nicely. Don't get hit by that. You know what? Again, we have so many... We have so much verticality. Why wouldn't you use a rope there? Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, get him, get him. Thank you. Still tons of time. I'm getting myself freaked out. Because I'm like, I'm pretty sure we have to take the key up to the top as well. But this is potentially, like, Pog City. It hurts. It hurts a little. Definitely we want the bomb box. We don't have a skeleton key. Oh, which sucks because, you know, there's probably, like, a hired help in there, dude. I thought that worked. I would say... If you don't get the Kapala, totally fine. Embrace it. This is like, you need to get the Ujad Eye to make some healthy progress. I think we gotta throw a bomb up here. I think we definitely did not need to throw it, <laughs> now that I think about it. In fact, we didn't need to do that at all, but... I'm not even going to say that saved us time, but it opened up a new path, that's for sure. Uh, and we're going to be so freaking close to the Kapala. I tell you that with authority. It's a race against time here. You knew something along those lines was coming. The ghost is here. We do not care. Should have taken the other path, but this is okay. We're still alive, that's the important part. And we're one altar away. Forget everything about that upper area. Why are you dead? It's weird, you must have been hit by the this thing. Probably has a name, but whatever. That's right. I said it. Very tempting. Volcania has a crate associated with it. Is this the run where we finally break our curse? I very much hope the answer is yes. <laughs> Glunk? Okay, that's sick. Now this is epic. That's a good get for us. Especially, again, the jetpack makes our maneuverability a lot better. Okay, so dude, yeah, let's do it. Let's let's do it. Let's go to Volcania. It's been screwing us enough. The time has come. I can't believe we're 22 minutes into this video, dude. I thought we were like four minutes in. You love to see this, though. Jetpack gun hopefully we can we can pog up get some shops in our future say it with me you know like lmfao shops 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 <laughs> everybody ah party music my favorite genre i love to i love the party rock there's probably some people have probably said that on ironically in their lives right she loved to party rock all the time. So that's free HP. How so? Watch and learn, sweetheart. Boom. Look at that. What did I tell you? It's a simple 17 step process. Okay. I care not. Well, that's not fair. I was going to say I care not for Monty. That's not fair. I do care for Monty. And with the jetpack, it would be foolish not to at least give it a try. We definitely want to free Van Helsing. Because we could get Vlad's cape. Um, I don't think Vlad's cape is... And I did see this, by the way. But wasn't sure if it was worth a bomb. Then I thought about it for two seconds. And I was like, yeah, it's worth a bomb. So yeah, I'm thinking I'm back. Had to be done. Um... Hello. I have no idea who Tusk is, by the way, but thanks for the diamond. Just go ahead and blow up for me, but don't ruin that shop. Beautiful. A little scary, a little scary. 
You know what? Might as well get Monty down here. Um, I completely forgot what I was talking about like three seconds ago. I'll just level with you, dude. Like, train of thought has not been crushing it uh, on this lack of sleep game. That's a little spooky. Hello. Honestly, I would like the HP. But, and it's pretty easy to get. But I am also like, at the same time, with 29,000, I think I'd rather save for like a killer item from a shop. Um, we don't really need more than eight HP. Oh, I remember what I was gonna talk about, Vlad's Cape. I honestly think people overrate Vlad's Cape a little bit. Like triple jump is obviously, or maybe it's double jump and a flap. Is not bad, but like, I mean, it's obviously demonstrably good. But if you gave me the choice between that or a jetpack, I would take the jetpack. I know that jetpacks explode. Sadly, we've been living that life. Come on, come on, come on. Uh, raise your hand if you saw that one coming a mile away. I'm raising my own hand. We could still get it though. Just don't crush it accidentally. A little spooky. There's already a clover on this floor. We don't necessarily have to kill the Dracula or the, the Leprechaun. On the other hand, it would definitely also be okay to kill the Leprechaun. And then we get the clover on the way in as well. So we don't have to be as fast or as reckless. So why am I not just pushing the thing? I don't really want to aggro the shopkeepers if we can get around it. So we're just doing a little a little scouting mission, if you don't mind. Also, like it would be nice if possible to not have so much flipping lava in our way. Uh, on the way down, I wonder if we'll get the pot of gold from hitting the drill. I think the answer is definitely no. No matter what, though, we are we are getting some lava. I think you can't really get around that on on this current build. No aggro, though, is very positive. This is where things are going to get a little goofy, though. What's, what the heck is going on there? Like, this just basically sucks. We can wait a long time, though. Like, I'm not suggesting it's necessarily gonna empty out. I mean, we could throw some bombs into it, too, if we wanted to. This thing's got me, got me freaking a little bit. Don't. Like, it seems pretty stable. Good. We're crossing. We're crossing. We're crossing. What the heck? <laughs> I'll use a bomb. I'll use a bomb to kill a turkey there. So we've freed Van Helsing, dude. This is pretty good. We got double clovers. Shopkeepers are not mad. It's no guarantees, but it's a it's a pretty good setup. Just wanna, you know, make sure we're exploring everything fully. I mean, we could trade jetpack for a cape. It's an age-old spelunky debate. What's better, jetpack or cape? It's a very weird debate because the answer is jetpack. You love to see that. Don't trigger any arrow traps unnecessarily. You got three ropes. You can do stuff with the ropes. That one's already gone off. There's usually a ton of crates in Vladimir's palace. That's not a lot of crates, unfortunately. It's a lot of gold, but in this business, we're, we're not upset to see gold. Try not to trigger the ghost pot accidentally. 
That's something I'd throw out there as like a good idea. Not bad. Arrow traps. We fear the arrow traps. Thanks! I gotta say, Van Helsing, that was pretty disappointing. Go back the way you came. Like, I'm pretty sure we killed Dracula by dropping him. I don't know, man. Like, sure, is Vlad's cape? It doesn't explode if you get hit. But on the other hand, like, maybe I've never picked it up in this build. I gotta tell you, I think I'm a jetpack guy. I think this is one of those things where it's like, people are divided. I definitely do not think it's one of those things where people are like, oh, you're just like, seriously missing out. That's, that's my hope, at least. Okay, so this is really good. And remember, we haven't even killed shopkeepers, dude. So this is, this is sick. What does mine say? Sweet. This is good, dude. I mean, it's safe. I shouldn't say it's good, because we still only have two items. But, like, we have two of the better items in the game. Both spring shoes and... I mean, actually, we have three items, because you definitely would count uh, the jetpack as an item. We got three, like, very, very... Oh, my God. Solid items. You know, we're not talking about, like... Yeah, you got the compass, but, like, your other item is a web gun. I guess we got four items, because you count the, the frost gun as well. Um, so we're actually, like, in my estimation, we're kind of killing it. And we haven't aggroed shopkeepers. Yet, we have a good supply of bombs. I am worried about the pack exploding and destroying me. I'd say that's a very likely cause of death. Can I tell you something that, that you'll like to hear, I think? That's a great dude. The Kapala counters that, because the pack does 11. Oh, that's pretty good, too. When it explodes. So all we need to do is a little bit more sacrificing. I'm just trying to kill the moon challenge now. Careful. There we go. Uh, all I'm trying to do is get to the Kapala. Or, I mean, just getting more than... Uh, 11 HP would also do something, but... So what would... If I had the opportunity... Like, let's let's play a theory crafting game here. If I had the opportunity to buy whatever I wanted to buy... If I, if I could, you know, pack a shop with the items I wanted to see, what would I want to see? I would definitely want a shotgun. That's, that's probably, like, the biggest upgrade right now. If I can get a shop gun, a shotgun, I should say, without aggravating the shopkeeper, that would be amazing. Apart from that, I would say that would pretty much put us, like, where we want to be. What the heck? Alright, now that's sweet. Now this is epic. Everything else... Uh, you know what? A compass is always nice, especially when we get to those more unfamiliar levels for me. I don't want to go that way. That's that's a nightmare. Sorry, I just gotta... There we go. <laughs> just gotta finesse it. It's so much easier to play this game without having you know, 4,000 shopkeepers on every single floor that are mad at you. Like, we've taken very little damage. This is gonna be the Olmec fight, dude. That's crazy. You're crazy. It's just a very nice, solid run. So I will get the gold. Because for once... Whoo, we actually want it. You know what? I, I missed an item as well. In, in my estimation of uh, what's good. We need paste. That That's like... It's not 
non-negotiable, but it's so insanely important. I will also level with you without paste. I don't know how we're going to get Olmec to to fall cuz we got to bust up his uh <laughs> We got to bust up his uh his UFO thrusters. We need him to fall to get to the Ankh, too. I guess what I'll try to do is is freeze him. We do have great maneuverability. So hear me out here. I think we try early. It, it like, they turn blue. I don't know. We, we might have to whip them, which is going to be... Believe it or not, I'm going to just go ahead and say it. I, I don't think it's that hard. Which is like, I'm, I'm inviting some comedic timing into my life, for sure. But I, I genuinely think it's not going to be that hard. Because we have the jetpack. Oh, it, dude, it totally works. It totally still works. Okay. Well, this is, like, horrible. Never mind, he's still shooting bombs. <laughs> I was gonna say, if anything, he's gonna have, like, a tighter spread now. We have jetpack as well, so don't, don't sweat it, dude. You got, you got lots of opportunities here. I don't know what that door is. I just realized that now. Just play it cool. Just play it cool. We're just we're just taking it slow. You know, this isn't the way we drew it up back at the academy. So we're taking our time. This is not the normal way we do this. So we slow down. We slow it down. We wait for it. Because this is a big run. This is a run where we can actually make some progress for the first time in a little while. We got great stuff. We got 31 bombs. Although I'll level with you. I don't see how we're nuking Osiris with uh, no paste. I'm dancing. I'm not talking about Ted. good news is, hold on, we gotta get our fuel back. The good news is, there's gonna be no space left for this fool. <laughs> the bad news is, I gotta land a shot at some point. Is my, is my platform still there? It is. It's really hard to land a bomb on that one individual spot. He got a little frozen. Wait for it. Greed. <laughs> oh my god, he's still not dead, dude. We gotta land on him so we get some fuel. Tackle him fuel. It is fair to say that this is a bit of a mess. I like that rope, though. You think this is just a direct hit? Nope. I don't know, maybe even a whipping is more accurate here. I don't like this position. This is a scary spot. Get some fuel back. Don't like it. I don't like it. I'm like, maybe you just place a bomb under one of these when he's coming by. I think that might be the way. He's gonna bounce. And then he's gonna go donk a donkey donk That's not gonna be good enough, obviously. 
What about here, though? He pushed it off. You're a real piece of crap. You know that? Okay, go, go, go. We're gonna get him. I know you're like, you're not gonna get him. We're gonna get him. It's just gonna take, it's gonna be a matter of time. It's not pretty. We broke one side. That's fine. <laughs> He's not dead, dude! Are you kidding me? There's like no space for you! Oh my god. The pace, dude. I would, I would just kill for some friggin' paste. There, we got it. We froze one of his jets. Froze the second jet. Wait it out. This is a wait. This is a run out the clock situation. We're close. I wouldn't do it here, you got no fuel. Oh my god. I'm losing my patience a bit. <laughs> so I would not wish this way of murdering Olmec on my worst enemy. Ladies and gentlemen, there's I was just going to say there's no way this guy isn't going into the friggin drink. Okay, so I don't know, that was like a 10 to 15 minute? Oh, it was an 8 minute Olmec fight. Okay. Well, um... You know? I'm glad we didn't just give up. But it will be hilarious if somehow, like, we just die on the next floor. So one way to do things. I now know a little more about this game. The whole path we're taking here in the Duad allows us to get... A consumable. Well, not a cons. Well, I guess it's, it's an item. It's an item that does nothing except tell us where uh, an item we actually respect is. So apparently, there's like other ways to do it. I don't know. I guess you could probably go uh, tide pool path and do things that way. But I, I, I just don't know what I'm doing in that department, so I really do think we're going to the temple, dude. I'm gonna eat a lot of peaches. Is this lava? It can't be. Well, there goes the parachute. <laughs> Alright. Not letting this per proceed. Persist. There we go. Um... Feeling okay. Feeling okay. That's beautiful. That's what you love to see. Do not fear the cat. Oops. We got a hired help down here. Okay. I see you. I don't know what I'm going to do about you, but I do see you. Okay, that's what I'm going to do about you. It's amazing how well that went.
we face a sincere issue. How are we going to kill Osiris? If, like, we haven't made the City of Gold yet. But how are we going to kill Osiris? Obviously something going on with those challenges, but... Just had to look. You gotta look. You never know the City of Gold might be there. In its own way, this is actually really freeing. Because it means we can just play the game. We no longer... I don't have a jetpack anymore because it exploded. Um, it, it means we could just play, you know? We don't have to concern ourselves with the... The other aspects of life. <laughs> It does also suck really badly. But I think, honestly, I'm still impressed with myself. You know, I think this run didn't have everything that we would normally consider. Essential. And yet here we are. Still pogging. Careful. Don't hit the crocodile. So just to just to generate something on this run would would still be I mean, it's not like we're like, oh no, potentially just another basic Spelunky 2 win. Like, we're still definitely at the point where we're like, that's... That's good stuff. Just like, a couple less uh, of these sorceresses would, would go a long way. I don't trust you for a second. Going down? Nope. I mean, the Kapala would be nice. Like, it's not like the game's almost over. This, this ain't your granddad's Spelunky. I have no quarrel with you. That being said, we're out. You're the one who's out, Gobby. Out of his mind. We're, we're going. We're going. This could still be a good run. It just sucks to lose the Ankh. Literally like steps away from the, the city of gold. But whatever. Alright, you've cursed yourself, dummy. What now? We're going down through the sand. Just to be on the temple is like... You know, it's not an everyday occurrence for me. So, I did not properly consider how wrong that could have gone. We're fine. There's our exit. I mean, this is like a... This is a clear just get the heck out of town situation. Great stuff. Sorry, I didn't get a hired help. Times have been a little tight been a little lean lately oh god no <laughs> still i had a really good time on that run for now thanks for watching hope you enjoyed if you did click the like button it's a great deal of course subscribe if you want to see more in the future for now thanks for watching i'll see you next time see ya